Good morning, everybody. Orange Jay here with another War of the Visions video, and it's dark, it's early, it's Friday morning, so this is a very long Friday for the channel. We've got a patch in the morning, work, you know, in the working part of the workday. Then we've got polls and Friday night fights tonight. Okay, it's going to be a day, and we're going to go ahead and start today with this patch review. Now, the first thing I want to mention, like I usually mention during these patch reviews, is the daily purchase bonus. And I don't know, like, who is doing what kind of recreational activity that makes these sometimes, but get these energy pots off of the whale purchase bonus it's insane at this point that we're still thinking that like hey if you're a big whale you need 50 large energy pots my brand new account does not need 50 large energy pots that's crazy now the 100 shards is great and then the daily purchase bonus part of this is fine too but just replace this with something actually useful in my opinion i i just hate to see the energy pots there there's been pushback against that before and it's a personal like it's just a personal grievance of mine at this point that I don't like to see those there. Also, the month just reset, so you need to spend your monthly tokens. Maybe I'll go ahead and do that. I'll do that in a different video for this new account, but uh, cash these in. Make sure you're selling your gill snappers for full price or getting your Esprit XP doubled or whatever it is. Okay, next, on to the banners. There's some interesting ones here today. First of all, Dario is not purchasable. We didn't think he was going to be like Katone and Shadow Links were, but Dario not going to be purchasable. You're going to have to pull him like you would pull another 100 cost uh, Warrior of the Crystal unit, which is he's Apocalypse Festival, I guess. So here's his regular banner. You'll see on here that his drop rate is 0.4%. You do have the boosted drop chance at Astrius the Erudite, Shadow Links the Crystal Board, and Lucio Light of Brilliance on here as well so you might get lucky and hit one of those on the way to dario but hopefully you just hit dario on this step up banner you could do this thing twice this is definitely where you should start pulling uh discounted pulls at the beginning guaranteed mind spheres and shards on steps three and four and look there's large energy pots right there. Turns out for 2,500 Vizior or two poles, you get almost, you get more than half of the whale purchase bonus worth of energy pots. That whale purchase bonus sucks. Okay, so there's that. I managed to work that back in. Then if you have some paid visit you're working with, you can go here to just uh, try to boost your chance at not hitting that coin pity. There is some shards. But for people without paid, you're going to start here and you're going to go here for Dario. Now, some other interesting banners. We have a Darkness Festival banner, which is going to be your Warriors of the Darkness Crystals. Yeah, <laughs> Servants of the Void. There we go. You could do this four step once a day that you could select one of those units, boost their chance, and it's just like Dario's four step. Or, if you have paid skip straight to here and get one of these units at level 120 so you click summon you pick dialdo vega or rysol dialdo is definitely the most like meta of the bunch right here although vega did see some more play fairly recently he's his resurgence was a few excuse me a few months ago and it has dropped off a little bit since then but still a good unit and then rysol I mean, Rysol's a cool unit, but not seeing something that, like that not played at the top of the game. Dialdo, though, still is one of those top tanks in the game. So that unit's great, and there's a way to get him for 120 or for 2,000 paid viz. Okay, now, how are you going to get that paid viz? Well, let's go look at the shop real quick, break down what's going on in there. Uh, you can see I desperately need to do my metal exchange for the month so I can cash in my snappers. In the special shop, we are still looking at the Lunar New Year's packs. Two more weeks left on these things. So this what this hasn't refreshed. You're still looking at 47 bucks to get you that 6,000 paid, which would, you know, more than get you that Dialdo if you wanted to. Other than that, nothing changed there. The Apocalypse Fest here. Come here, friend. I have a guest uh, speaker today. Baby Jay's watching. Anyhow, the Deluxe Festival, adult, or the Apocalypse Festival Deluxe Pack, there's nothing special going on in here. Nothing that we're not used to seeing. So, I there's the best thing to spend paid viz on today is that Dialdo, I think. I wouldn't, I wouldn't really spend any paid viz in there. The Apocalypse Festival Shop, we're going to get Arena Restores every day again, which that's great. Uh, especially for this account who's going to actually hit Arena this week once I level up my 
Espers, which is going to be a big power spike on the new player account today. Here's a Rainbow Vision Sphere pack you can buy every day. Then we have kind of the normal stuff. Antler and Elemental Materials for a 1,000. That's worth. You are Transcendence pack. If you need some scrolls, I could see that being an okay thing to pick up a couple of times. Then it's like start skipping, maybe until you get some of these pots or you get to stuff for Gil if you're swimming in Gil. For Dario Shop, we do have a 300 paid ticket, and I will probably pick this up on this account. I have uh, 945 paid, so I can snag that with the remnants of my Vizior. Then we do get a free pull ticket every day, which is really nice. And, dude, wait, loading. Apparently, we get a free pull ticket every day if it doesn't crash the game. Okay, so there it is. You guys ever notice it's really hard for a two year old to like not move, like to sit still? It's very difficult. Yeah, yeah not move. Anyway, we get Dario shards for Gil. Make sure you're picking those up. I haven't even picked up the, the Katone one yet because you could see my Gil situation. It would actually break me. But make sure you are getting those for him. Then we have the Dialdo, Vega, and Rysol shop. If you pick up one of those and need to get some shards. And that's it for new shops. Let's go look at... Hey, shh, buddy. I'm working, all right? You can watch, but please be quiet. In here, make sure you get your February medals turned in this week. This is the last week to turn those in. I cashed mine in for Dark Esper Shards. So I scrolled way down here, and I think some people don't realize you could do this. Uh, Dark Siren, I cashed all 35 of mine in for her. And then we're starting to build the March medals now. So that's great. Okay, here's Dario's shop. This is where you can change your medals into Coin Pity Him or get his shards. Here's shop for Rysol Vega Dialdo. Again, I don't coin pity them if you can avoid it but there's where you can get some shards and that's it and like i said not a whole lot going on in the patch today but before you go sell some gill snappers or something like that do make sure you are cashing in your monthly medals and then for everybody who uses my amazon link here buddy can you there's just so just i want to say thank you and, and channel members like i don't shout the channel members out enough but if you're somebody who's actually clicked the join button and join the youtube channel i uh, really appreciate you like it helps a small channel like mine out a lot and this is gonna be a busy day so i will see you all after school today we're gonna do some polls we're gonna do some friday night fights it should be an absolutely insane stream if you could put down final fantasy 7 remake for a little bit oop had to touch it he had to there was no avoiding there was no avoiding that it, it was a must do um so yeah if you want to join the stream that would be amazing i've been playing final fantasy 7 remake a little bit myself and the camera has really been the only thing that i haven't loved about the game but i'm only like an hour or so in so uh looking forward to finishing that uh lucas do you have anything you want to tell the people no what do you, you don't want to tell them anything can can you count to 10 or something no, you can't. You could can count to 10. What the? Okay, well, I guess that's it then. Thank you all for watching. Have a great day and I'll catch you next time. There's a lot of monsters. Yeah, we get those monsters though. All right, peace.